There are a wide variety of types of negotiations that all of us are engaged in all the time. If you're leading a group of people, if you're holding regular meetings, the ability to drive your agenda, the ability to build consensus for your ideas, the ability to make mutual concessions to create mutual value, those are general leadership skills and they apply to folks whether you're in an explicit negotiation role or not. On a day-to-day -day basis, your interpersonal interactions with your team, internal to your company, and even in your personal relationships, can be viewed as a negotiation, and we can all get better at creating mutual value. The style that we use is extremely application-oriented. From the moment you show up, you start by negotiating a transaction. You get feedback on that transaction and find out how well you did. We debrief the transaction and talk about things you could have done to do better. But as soon as you're comfortable with that, we challenge folks to a series of increasingly complex transactions. We start with a single issue, single opponent transaction. We then add complexity to single opponent, multiple issue transactions. By the time the program's over, we're dealing with multiple party, multiple issue, complex team negotiations. And so people have a chance to practice a wide variety of real world challenges. The real satisfaction for me comes from hearing from folks who tell me that they were able to immediately apply some of the lessons from the class. And that can range from a UN official telling me how they were able to negotiate with a government minister to drive his agenda in a developing nation, to a very common example of executives telling me they were able to negotiate salary or compensation with an existing or new job opportunity. And I find that very satisfying that people find it practical.